Hey guys, welcome to part 10 of Let's Play Spider-Man Web of Shadows on the 360. In the last part we teamed up with everyone's favourite crazy invincible metal guy and now we're back as being Spider-Man or by ourselves I guess I should say because we're always Spider-Man and now we just gotta go and find some hidden people. Uh, how do I do this here? There we go. So pretty much what we just did in the last mission is what we kinda have to do now. It's that whole thing of, I think, uh, no, I must have already mentioned it, there's a big pattern of, oh, you can now do a new thing, or something's now slightly different. Go do a stupid amount of that. So now we just have to go and find all these hidden symbiotes. I think that's how you say it. I was doing some research, I think that's how Spider-Man says it. Symbiotes, symbiotes. I think it's just symbiotes. i got to stop doing this every part, nobody cares. Okay, so yep, so now we just get a chance to see the open world and see that, yeah, people really are just going insane, um, trying to murder me, which isn't that, you know, weird for Spider-Man, but still, I still don't encourage it. Still not a fan. Oh, okay, thanks for the heads up. Honestly, couldn't care. No, don't give me five black points for that, that's not my fault. I didn't know there was somebody being hurt. Well, it did come up on the map, sure, but I, I was busy. They, that, they should have been able to figure out themselves, okay? That's their fault right there. Okay, so with this mission, uh, one thing, uh, not, I guess, noteworthy, but if you don't trigger the symbiotes, then it doesn't count towards your counter. So if you go around the city, sometimes crazy people like this will just attack you, but they don't count. You have to trigger them, so I don't know if all of these guys are going to count. So yeah, I just defeated that guy, but because he was already activated, it didn't count. So some people are just already crazy. They're just—they don't even care. They—they they won't let society like take them down. <laughs> he went for the head bar. I admire his courage. He's now dead, but I do admire his courage. Right, one more. That's all we need. One more. Are you, this guy? No, that's not someone. I thought I saw someone there. The camera's kind of freaking out a little bit because I'm using my spidey sense. I'm like locking on to all the events that are going on. So it's kind of freaking out. It's like it's trying to lock onto them as well as point out everyone. And honestly, I don't want that. I just want to do the mission. Alright, well, let's go back to being normal Spider Man because it's better. Where's Wolverine at? Oh yeah, of course, Wolverine magically teleported in the last part, so I guess we now got to find where he teleported to. I didn't know that was one of his superpowers, but I'm pretty proud of him for doing it. Alright, let's see what he wants. Good job, Spider-Man. He took out enough of those creeps to give us a chance. Thanks, but I have a bad feeling this is going to get a lot worse before it gets better. If we don't stop this, the city will fall into chaos. I'm pretty sure we achieved chaos quite a while ago. How about a little less joking, and a little more fighting? Okay, okay, look. We have to find the source of these people. I have a feeling that Venom is behind this. I suggest we split up and look for him. He's out there, hiding in the dark somewhere. So, what are your thoughts on the new duds? This some kind of damn superhero fashion show. Cause I got some orange and brown tights that put you to shame. What, not a fan of the new me? <laughs> First off, you smell like death. Second, you look like one of those emo kitties they got all over the internet gibbering on about how hard their life is when they've never even known true pain. Oh my god, you have a MyFace page, don't you? Dork. I do not. Ah, <laughs> you totally do. Shut up, kid. Will you add me as a friend? I'll poke you, you poke me back. I said shut up! <laughs> well, there we go. Learned some very interesting things there. Apparently, um, in this universe, there's no Facebook or MySpace. It's my face. Was that what it was called? I already forgot somehow. And uh, I think there, there was a little jab at Spider-Man 3 with the whole emo kids. I, I, I would guess that's what they were going for. I might be wrong, but you never know. I don't recall them 
fighting you, Parker. What are you doing to these people? You should believe in adoption, Parker. After all, you're the mommy. Kids, come meet Parker. Show Parker how much we love him. Yep, so now this is... well actually it's not... I guess it's technically not the beginning of the Phenom fight, but we have a, our second Phenom fight coming up, so at the beginning we just got to defeat more of these people. Which seems a bit lazy, I mean, we just did that. I don't know why they would get us to do it again. I don't know why Phenom would think that this would work. We're Spider-Man! We've done this a few times now, Phenom. Like, come on, you don't have to, you know, insult our intelligence here. Alright, where did Phenom go? <laughs> Why did he just run off over here? Why wouldn't he, like, fight us a little bit? Seems very cowardly, this big mutant guy. Right, so now I guess this is technically the start of the fight, so I haven't played this game in a while, so excuse me if I do awful, or more bad than before actually, I shouldn't, I always do quite terrible, so if I do, if I somehow underperform, I do apologise, right, why, boom, nice. So at the start of this fight, you can't damage him, so I think the thing that lets you damage him is if you take on, oh, oh, Jesus, coming this way if you destroy this pod, because this pod is creating more baby venoms, and that just won't do. And apparently it's connected to venom in some way. Oh, I keep pressing... <laughs> I keep pressing the analog stick to move the camera, because I've been playing uh, Kingdom of Hearts, and I have, like... Or I don't have automatic camera on, so I constantly move the stick. And of course, in this game, that's not how it is. Right, we're very badly damaged, so I think the best thing to do is to just casually run away for a bit. Cowardly, yes, but I think it's um, fine. I don't think I... No, I must have mentioned it. But yeah, your health does regen, just in case I didn't mention it. Okay, so now we can actually take on Venom, but I wouldn't recommend doing the web striking. Because uh, as you just saw, it didn't really work out for me there. Where did he go? Oh, dope. Ah. Okay, so Venom is a lot like Wolverine, only somehow stronger, which is awesome. So you kind of really got to look out for his attacks. And if you're going to web strike him like I did, it's very possible to do. It's just risky. You could do a lot of damage or he could just eat you. I mean, it's a, if you want to take the risk, you can do it. Right, so now we got to stop Venom. I, I don't quite know what this entails though. Um, Venom's right there, we can easily catch him, but if I remember correctly, if we do... Oh, a token! Might as well get it. Easy. No, Spider-Man, don't... I know we're in the middle of a boss fight here, Spidey. But, oh god, he's coming this way. <laughs> I'm just, I don't want to be locked onto Venom. Right, up. There we go. Right, where's Venom? Yeah, I think if we do... Oh, no, cutscene. Not the, not the best cutscene, but it still counts. So this is really weird, this part. You sometimes have to fight him, you sometimes don't. Um, I can't quite figure it out. This is the third time I've done this fight now, and I'm going to see if anything interesting happens, because it seems like you're not really meant to damage him. Wait, where did he go? There he is. See, he just kind of jumps around and has a laugh. Right, let's try and... Oh. See, as you can see, when I press Y, I kick. And if you remember, before I unlocked the web strike, pressing Y only kicked. Which means that we can't web strike Venom. And as you also just saw, he heals himself. But I don't... It, this is... It feels glitchy, this bit. Because Venom is just going to stomp around having a good time. Oh, boom. Oh, damn it. 
I think when he's doing that, when he's like going all weird, that means he's going to like bite you or eat you a little. No, stop attacking my civilians. That's right, Spider-Man owns the people. He saves them enough. I think he owns a couple of them at least. So yeah, so this is all that Venom's going to do. He's just going to jump around, have a good time. Sometimes you can attack him, sometimes you can't. Like, I think even if I ran up to him in this situation, nothing would really happen. I mean, now he seems a little annoyed. What's he doing? But, okay, so I've done this battle twice now. I think it is just a case of wait, and then he'll eventually get to where you need to go. And it seems pretty awful. And I don't quite get what it is with Treyarch, with the Spider-Man games. They love having a chase scene. But they they obviously didn't have any ideas here. It's just like, Venom's running Rampage? Like he's going... Oh god, here he comes. Like, he's just going a little bit nuts. Oh, no, no, cancel that. Oh! Oh, okay, I thought B was the cancel. Apparently not. Interesting. But as you can see, I I just damaged him. And he, I think once you eventually fight him, he will have the same amount of health. But he just eats people and heals himself. So you can go up and punch him. Oh god. <laughs> okay, just, just the little baby ones. You can go up and punch him. It's just pointless. So all you, you just got to watch him. And because this game is a little glitchy, maybe, uh, maybe have a little fun with him as well. He will do some stupid stuff if you let him. Oh, boom. Nice. Should have done the B one though, that was awesome. No, no, he's off again. Oh, see you, Venom. I, I guess he was done fighting me or something. Like, Venom doesn't have a goal here. That's what makes me so confused. Like, Venom isn't fighting you. He's not really running away. And he's not really doing anything. He's just eating people. Because I guess he likes to eat people. So it's like, what's he, what's he doing? And I'm not too sure when he's going to head back and head to the alleyway, because later on... Oh! I, oh, I guess he just... Oh. Well, I guess he's doing that now. That person kind of went a bit mental there. But no, um, I already recorded this part, but I wasn't happy with it. And I hope he does it again. But in the part I didn't use, or the version of this fight I didn't end up using, he kept glitching into cars. Maybe I'll add in the footage anyway if he doesn't do it, but he just kept running into cars and he just would get stuck on them. It was so good. It was so good. And so far in this Let's Play, most of these boss battles have had some sort of glitch in them. So I was hoping he would do it again, but no, he's just jumping around. Oh, no, no, I think this is it. This is the next part of the fight. Okay, so just as before, you can't hurt Venom until you destroy these pods. So what you kind of got to have to do is try and lock onto them. Nope, no, I want to lock onto the pods. Nope, don't want to do that. It can be really annoying to do. There's a pod. But you kind of got to try and destroy them before Venom beats you up. And as you can see, it's very easy for that to happen. There we go. Web striking, I found, is the best way to do it. Although, if you mess up like I just did, <laughs> it clearly isn't. Okay, boom. Oh, bloody hell. Okay, web strike. What's going on? Oh, I think I'm dead. Nope, not quite yet. Oh, no, I guess web striking is not the way to go. Okay, I think I might just have to die. There we go. Whoops. So, you've got to be quick. you got to be so quick with this stuff. you just got to go destroy the pods. Because Venom is invincible. So there's no point attacking him. And if you let the pods just make more guys, eventually it's just... there's going to be a lot of guys. And that really did escalate quickly though. Okay, avoid him. No, okay, well... Get out of the way, Venom. No, I don't want to attack Venom. 
So what makes this part of the fight bad, like annoying and bad, is that Spider-Man will try and attack everyone else but the pods, but the pods are the only thing worth attacking. Okay, that's one. Okay, now we just gotta get lost, Venom. I can't see. Stop locking on to... No, I didn't want to do that. want to destroy the pods. Okay, almost done. Nope, didn't want to... Come on, punch the... No, that kick was cool, but not really what I wanted. Okay, now we're just gonna run away. Which, once again, is very cowardly. I'm okay to admit that, but... Um, I just want my health to regen before I take on Venom myself. Right, where did he go? Wow, I really got out of there quick. Oh, did you just punch me? Somebody just... Don't clap. Yeah, sc screw you, buddy. Just... What? Come on, do it. Do it. Be a man. I know you did it. I know... Somebody punched me. I've got a, like, a mutant creature over there waiting to fight me, but I know it was you. Right, get run over. God, what a prick. Some people, you try and save, like, Manhattan and New York, and they just, they just punch you. I don't think it was him that actually punched me, but somebody did. I'm not happy about it. Ooh, that was cool. Okay, so now for this section of the fight, it's actually the final part, um, or the final, yeah, you know, thing of the fight. Stage, I guess, is the best word for it, maybe. There we go, boom. So you just gotta now get him down to, you know, next to no health. Or maybe all of his health, actually. Can't quite remember. Bit odd in this game, in that regard. Bit all over the place. So don't, you gotta go all in now. Oh god, I'm being killed. But don't be afraid to run away. That's my advice, because a big problem with this fight as well, or why it can be annoying, is that that anyway is tiny. And then the pods spawn a stupid amount of enemies, so you can get really stuck in there. No, not dealing with you. So if you just don't get out of there and let yourself heal, it can be really annoying. Like, really irritating. And just hard as well. But if you kind of come out here and let them all attack you, then it's a little bit easier. You can get some decent shots of Venom. Because Venom, just like Wolverine, can take down your health quick. Oh, there he is! Speak of the devil! Just talking about you, Venom. Weird coincidence, that. Yeah, he can really wear you down health-wise. Oh god. That was me. I messed up. So, you don't even really want to risk it. But also, because at this point, we have some pretty cool combos. So, I can also wear down Venom quite quick. I just need to stop fighting these tiny guys. Oh, I wish they would just leave me alone. Right, where is Venom? Where'd he go? Don't tell me where- Oh, there he is! Okay, boom. Yes. So if you get the web strike timing just right, you can really like wear his health down. Like, look at that. So much damage. Right, where is he? Nope. I'm going to punch you first. Apparently Venom isn't very good at uh, on-the-wall combat. Can't say I blame him. Okay, boom. Oh, damn it. Okay, and boom. No. What's going wrong here? Damn it. <laughs> it's so funny that he has like a little super move that he does. That he like charges up for a second. I'm having a hard time locking onto him though. I know I am locked onto him, but Spider Man's just going mental here with all these wall kicks. They're pretty cool. Okay. Stop blocking Venom. It's, it's a coward's game. You just gotta mush and bash. Oh. B. Oh, nice. I should start using B more often. B's awesome. And. And. Dead? Oh, dead? Go and hurry up and die. <laughs> what a coward. Mm, I had no idea how many of these pods Venom had made, or how he did it but I knew I had to stop him from pulling any more people into them. Mm-hmm, so that was the second Venom fight, and uh, it could have been a bit better. It was a bit rough around the edges. But anyway, it's time to end off the part, so next time in Let's Play Spider-Man Web of Shadows on the 360, we're going to destroy some hives. Woo! I'm not talking about beehives, alien hives. It's going to be a treat. So either way, I've been Honestom23, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe, and I will see you next time.